Good to see you here. Today we are talking about what is in my travel tech pouch. And this is the pouch where I carry all of my dongles, cords, all the necessary tech accessories. Well, that was a handful to say. We're talking about the tech pouch that I pack specifically for traveling. Before I show you what I use to organize all of the cords, dongles, and all that mess effortlessly, it'll help me out immensely if you could just smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Much appreciated on my side, and thank you so much for doing that. With that being said, this is the tech pouch that I use when I'm traveling. As you see, it's very bulky, but it's very stretchable. That's exactly what makes this so awesome. This tech organizer is made by side by side, and it's actually quite budget friendly. The regular price is $40, but at the time of me making this video, there's a sale going on right now for just 30. The materials used on this tech pouch actually feels quite nice, especially the stretchy part. And the zipper over here also feels very sturdy, especially when you're opening up and closing the zippers. It feels very very smooth and premium. There are two main compartments in this tech pouch. So here's the first compartment. Once you open it up, there's actually a divider in between. So you get a separate compartment on both sides. There's a lot of compression panels in this pouch, which makes it great because I can actually just store everything in here and find the exact core that I'm looking for effortlessly. So first you'll see I have my iPhone charger as well as the little tiny brick that I have from Anchor. This thing powers up my iPhone really fast. And I definitely recommend getting one of this little guy right here if you use an iPhone. On the same side, I have my MacBook Pro charging cable. And my AirPods Pro fits nicely right in between. Now let's take a look at the dividers right in the middle. There's actually a lot of accessories that I have on here, especially the SD cards over here. On the other two sides, there's also two more slots for maybe USB drive or SD cards. And then we have a mesh pocket that has a tiny zipper which also feels very nice when you're opening it up. I'm like very excited about all these little tiny details. So inside the mesh pocket, I have adapter for lightning cable to a headphone jack. And then I have an SD card case. Now, as you see, I don't have an SD card in here. This is where I keep all of the prepaid SIM card from different countries, as well as the SIM card opener. On the other side of the divider, this is where I keep most of my cords at. Basically, I have a cord for everything that I need or might need. Over here, I have a USB Type-C to Type-C and a USB Type-A to Type-C and then another USB Type-A to... Anyways, you get the point. What I really like about this divider is that everything is in its own place, so I can find them effortlessly, like real quick, right away. Right in the middle, there's a pen holder. And trust me, always bring a pen or pencil with you when you're traveling. It always comes in handy out of nowhere. At the end of this compartment, there's a few more compression panel. On the top, I have my microfiber cloth. I bring this pretty much everywhere with me just to wipe things clean. And then at the bottom, I have my dongle. Always carry a dongle because if you use a MacBook, you'll know my pain. This is also from Anchor and I believe this is the 5-in-1 dongle. There are two USB Type-A as well as SD card reader, micro SD card, and HDMI. And right behind all of this, there's a pocket where I keep my SSD. The one I have here is from SanDisk 2TB and this thing is fast and reliable. I recently had an upgrade to this and it's it's amazing. The other thing that I keep inside this pocket is a lightning cable to an SD card reader. So just in case if I need to use this for my phone or iPad. I'm still waiting to be able to use Final Cut on the iPad. Come on, we're almost there, right? hopefully. And that is it on this side of the compartment. Now to the other side, this is actually just one huge compartment that you can just basically squeeze everything that you need in here. So what I have here is a power bank from, I don't even remember the name, Jackery. This thing packs tons of power. And by the way, I'm gonna have all of these accessories down in the description if you're interested. And last but not least, we have my MacBook Pro charging brick. I feel like I packed tons of stuffs in here already and still it was able to close because of the stretchy material on the outside. Overall, I really like how everything is organized in here, especially once you open it up, everything is in sight. You know exactly where to go. And once you are done with that item, you can put it right back and know that it's protected in a secure place. And honestly, you don't really have to use this as a tech pouch if you don't want to. You can have anything in here. You can fit your Nintendo Switch in here or just all of the camera accessories that you need and the filters, 
SD cards, batteries, and all that good stuff. It's very nifty and holds a lot of stuff. Everything compressed in this size. And I can fit this easily in my backpack or any of the suitcase I have. All right, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button for me, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. By the way, feel free to add me on Instagram. I post stories there every day, as well as all the behind the scenes of the video that I'm currently working on. It'll be awesome to see all of you guys there. Anyways, as always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.